Hi guys, um, I had a couple customers ask me how to clean their swag lids. So they get a lot of tea and coffee under the slider and they soak it and they wash it and they can't get it out, okay? So the easiest way to clean this off is to take this piece off, okay? And how you do that is you're gonna flip it upside down, put it on a towel, okay, to protect it. I'm using a heavy duty spoon here because this is what I have. Um, I would use a regular spoon at home. Um, I would not use a fork or a knife because when you're pushing, you could slip and you could cut and hurt yourself. I would definitely use adult supervision when you're doing this. Um, spoon works for me great. I wouldn't use anything with like a sharp edge to push into this because you'll cut that silicone. And like I said, you're putting a lot of pressure and you could slip and cut yourself or hurt yourself. So be very, very careful. Okay, so what you do is you have the slider part shut put it upside down and you just take your spoon and push down really really hard and it will eventually pop as you can see it popped okay so you can then clean this little spot um this actually has two little silicone pieces this little piece right here um make sure you don't lose those because that's what keeps it from being leak resistant and then this little piece will actually pop off oh there it goes so this little piece will pop off you can clean in that make sure you don't lose those pieces the way it actually attaches is this little notch right here this little notch right here so to put after you've cleaned this to put it back together i just like flip it upside down so the silicone doesn't fall out flip the whole thing over and then just take your thumbs and push it back you'll hear it snap and it slides back and forth okay don't forget to take this ring off and you can clean all underneath of there because gosh knows what's going to grow under there. Um, but you just have to um, clean that and you can slide it right back on and then it'll keep your lid in place. Okay. So if you have a lot of tea and gunk under there, super easy. Like I said, please be careful because you are putting a lot of pressure down on this. You don't want to slip, slice your hand, fall into it spoon um is works for me you could still hurt yourself with a spoon if you slip but this is my choice <laughs> um find what works for you you could even cover it with a towel before you slice or before you push but you do have to put a lot of pressure on that okay so i hope that helps you guys um let me push my little silicone piece back in and you can hear it like i said i like to put it like this way and then flip it over so i know my silicone pieces stay in the spaces that they're supposed to be and it works perfectly hope you guys have a great day bye